Hi everyone, welcome to Key to Blogging and in this video I will show you how you can create a HTML sitemap page in your WordPress website. So if you are using WordPress and you want to create a HTML sitemap page then this video is for you. And by the way if you found this video helpful then make sure to hit the like button. So to create sitemap page in WordPress we need to install the Rank Math SEO plugin. So let me just go to plugin section and click on install plugins here. And here as you can see I have installed the Rank Math SEO plugin and in recent version 1.0.103 you will get the HTML sitemap feature in Rank Math. So first of all you need to update your existing Rank Math plugin or install your Rank Math SEO plugin in your WordPress website. So you can do that by clicking on add new button and you can simply search for Rank Math and here you can install this plugin. And after installing this plugin, you will see this option Rank Math and under the Rank Math, you will see this option Sitemap Setting. So just click on here and here you will see this option HTML Sitemap. Just click on here. Now you need to enable the HTML Sitemap button and here you will get the short code. You can paste this short code in a blank page and your HTML Sitemap page is ready. Or you can also select that page from here. So let's select the sorted by modified date and or you can select edge publish date here and here you can select item titles and click on save changes first. Now we need to create our HTML sitemap page so I will go to pages and I will click on add new here and I can simply set the title as HTML sitemap. Now you need to save the draft first and then here you can change the permalink like HTML sitemap and here you can publish this page. So before that let me just select the page layout to something like narrow and let me just publish this page. Now you can just paste that short code here in this page or you can just go to rank math and select this page as HTML sitemap. So I will go to rank math and I will go to sitemap settings and I will go to HTML sitemap and here I will click on page and I can select that HTML sitemap page here like this and I will click on save changes and you can also copy the short code and paste it in the page so let me just go to pages here and let me just open that HTML sitemap here in a new tab and as you can see the HTML sitemap page is added like this and here you can see this date and here you can see all the links like this. So this is how the HTML sitemap page looks like using the Rank Math SEO plugin and you can also further customize it using CSS code if you want. Now you can just copy the HTML sitemap page link here and you can add this link in the header menu or footer menu. So let me just change this link with the new HTML sitemap and what I can do is just go to customizer here and I will go to footer section here and I will select this element wizard2 and I will select the HTML sitemap here and I will change the HTML sitemap link here like this and let me just publish this page let's close this page now let me just refresh this page and let's go to home page first let me just scroll down and i will click on sitemap and it will take me to the sitemap html sitemap page so i think we need to refresh it first and then let's click on sitemap here and as you can see it is taking me to the html sitemap page so in this way you can add this page in the footer section and you can also add this page in the header section. So for this let me just go to dashboard and I will go to appearance and here I will click on menus here and then I can add the page here. So I will click on HTML sitemap and I will click on add to menu and I can add the menu under the block here like this and let me just save the menu now let's go to widget site 
and under the block i will see the html sitemap and user can easily navigate to different posts in your wordpress website through this html sitemap page now let's understand what are the benefits of html sitemap so if you use html sitemap then it helps you organize your large website in wordpress and it also helps search engine bot to crawl the web pages faster and index the pages faster in google search and it also distribute your page rank across your website and helps in internal linking so you should use your html sitemap page in wordpress and by the way you are not using rank math then you can just download the rank math plugin and use it in your wordpress website i have included the link in the description so if you found this video helpful then make sure to hit the like button and do subscribe our channel for more upcoming videos like this i will see you in the next video thank you